don't you just love airports? I tell you, Stansted at four o'clock this morning was like a Millwall pitch invasion. But here we are, we're in Norway, we're at Oslo Airport. Just gonna go pick up our bags, go find out where Maddie is. And then we've got two weeks pack rafting, hiking, fishing, bushcraft over in Sweden. class citizen now you haven't got an EU passport. Well that was fairly easy so let's go find Matt. Here he is. Hello, <laughs> how are we doing? Yeah good how are you doing? Oh shattered. Well that's easy to find. Found him easily enough. I don't know what's going on here but everything's going so smooth. Must be a sign of things to come. Right so I think we've got about two hours I reckon until yeah, two, we get two and a half hours, two and a half hours until we get to Glasgow again and uh, just a nice easy day today because uh, I think we're all both knackered. I've just flying. Matt's just driven up. So nice and easy day. So this spot, this is the reason that we're here. So I came to this spot about eight years ago uh, when we were um, traveling through to uh, to Varmland there to do some timber rafting and we, we stopped here for a night and I remember waking up about half past four in the morning and uh, hearing wolves over in the distance there and thinking to myself need to come back here so uh, that's half of the reason that we're here right then so here we are at Glasgow Ends visitors center here so Matt's just over there just trying to sort out any place where he can leave his canoe that he's brought over with him because he's here for six weeks and yeah here we are absolutely beautiful you can't beat the weather that we've got today and it's forecast to be pretty good for the whole duration as well right so we're just going to go in the visitor center now go pick up our cards and uh, then we'll make a slow way packing up because everything's in flight bags uh, you know all packed up for the trip and everything so we need to get all of our bags set up and uh, yeah and then we'll start making our way for today Cheers. Skull. This is double the size, double the amount I normally take when we're hiking, but obviously we're pack rafting as well. We're out for two weeks, so half of this is pretty much food. We've got fishing gear, got my camera gear. Um, so it's a heavy old thing to carry, but we've got about five kilo, five kilos, five K to walk today, I think. So not too bad. And then obviously when we're pack rafting, it's all spread out in the tubes of the, the MRS uh, micro raft. But yeah, that's a big old bag. Right, well there we are, all set up. It looks absolutely huge, doesn't it? I haven't heard that been said to me for a while. But yeah, life for two weeks while we're back. Right, let's let the adventure begin. First bit of water, and it looks beautiful. She's there. Good to be out on the water anyway. Glad to get that pack off my back. Good to be back out in Sweden as well. This is three years in the making this trip due to COVID. Been put on hold for three years. Just so glad to be back out and doing this. 
So it's now 10 to 6. I don't honestly know how far we've got to paddle to the first campsite. Got a bit of a headwind. But if we cut in between the trees, we should be okay. in these bigger lakes, you know? Um, I think there are some. Yeah, well, we'll probably see tonight, won't we? Yeah. When the wind drops, if there's anything rising. Absolutely beautiful, just in a osprey flow over. Alright. So get Campbell set up. Get some food on the go. And then a bit of a swim, I think. So after three years of putting this off and off and off because of COVID, it's all worth it. Definitely worth it just to be here, butt naked in this lake. Absolutely beautiful. Right, get dry, get some food on the go. I'm starving, I haven't eaten anything all day. I think it's gonna be an early one tonight. I really do. Because I'm absolutely knackered, so I'm going to get the fire on, I think, get some food on the go. And uh, early to bed, and then early up, I think, because I need to break out the fish fishing rods as well and uh, try and catch something. You know, this place is absolutely beautiful, absolutely amazing. It's literally right on our doorstep, really, if you think of it. For the sake of, what, half a day travelling for me today? Look where we are. Chicken and lime today. I haven't had this one before. Lovely. All right, leave that eight minutes. Right. All done. Lovely old job that was. Can of Brewdog IPA, Punk IPA, and then it's going to be bed, I think. Cheers, mate. Yucky da. Thanks for inviting me. Yeah.